Hello, welcome along to Bangkok Chit Chat with Andrew and Andy. And today is a part one of a video that we simply call Thai Prisons. And we're going to be looking at using prisons as a tourist attraction on this video. Before we start, I'd like to welcome back one of our favorite guests <laughs> ever. It's uh, Gail Bailey, MBE, back in the house. <laughs> Thank you very much, kind sir. I nearly called you Bail Gailey. Oh, no, some people, Judy Fitzgerald used to call me Bail Gailey. Would you bring yeah, me yeah, home, Bail yeah. Gailey? <laughs> <laughs> ah, right, okay, so, yeah. yeah. And right, so, a little, little bit of a background from uh, Gail. She, got the, she won the MBE. Congratulations. How long ago was that? Uh, six years. Six years. Yeah. And you still got it. You still got take it, yeah. it back. No, no okay. like egg. <laughs> They're not having it back. <laughs> and the main reason you got it was because of your support of uh, it was foreign prisoners and visiting. Chari charity work in Thailand, yes. yes right. Yes. And part of that is... Uh, you, oh, you yes. A lot of that is, was that, yes. In fact, one of the prisoners actually wrote uh, to support the, the, uh, the award. I think, I'm not even sure whether he actually imp started it off because you, they, you nominate them, it has to be supported. All right, okay, okay. So, yeah. Well, congratulations so, yeah, thank again. You. Thank yeah. you, dear. All right, mm. okay. Are you still, you're still doing the visits? Yes. Okay, and oh, oh. It, it was, was over the COVID period, was it stopped? Oh, yes, stopped completely, yeah. It's still yeah. stopped though, at the moment? No, oh. I don't think so, no. I've been, um, I went two days before I had my knee done. Right. To see both guys. Mm. Two, did a double whammy, two prisons, but in the same complex. So uh, there's something that we were talking about the other day about which one is which. So to make it clear to, to the viewers, <laughs> Pre Klong Prem is the Chachuchak one, right? Which is a women's yes. high security. Well, it's men's. women's uh, drug rehabilitation, Klong Prem, uh, hospital, and also Bangkok Remand. That that's just called Bangkok Remand oh. prison. In one complex. It's in one complex, but. All mm. totally separate, and s s even the two prisons I visit have separate uh, rules and regulations. Yeah. They don't have standard rules and regulations. This is Thailand. Yeah, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Oi! <laughs> and the other one is uh, at near uh, the, the river. Uh, the other one Quang, is at Nantabury, yeah. Bang Quang, and yeah. that's for prisoners that have over 20 years. They're long-term prisoners, yeah. and I think that's 20. the. Over 20 years, yeah. I've got one for you, but the infamous one, right, the Bangkok Hilton, is yes. referring to Klong Prem? I think it? It mainly it would be either Klong Prem or, or uh, Bang Quang. Okay. Bang Quang is, is the one with the big golden gates where some people go in there and, and don't come out again because they've got... <laughs> Not foreigners, but Thais have very long sentences. Well, we're going to get into that, I think, yeah, later yeah, on. Yeah. To, I know. Okay. So. Okay. So what we're doing is we're, this. This is in two parts. Uh, uh, what we're going to talk about now is uh, about the new initiative uh, by the uh, Justice Ministry, yeah, who want to bring in yeah. the this, this tourism, so tourists visiting a prison. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we're going to discuss that, and in part two. We're going to discuss about uh, punishment and, and rehabilitation and how Thailand is trying to change its image, uh, but also uh, certain rehabilitation uh, efforts are actually making it, which is, which is really quite fascinating. Well, I find it fascinating anyway. So what's happened is uh, the head of the, the prisons, Justice Minister Somsak Tip, oh my glasses. I'll just go first. Tip yeah. Tins, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Sat, yes. He basically uh, <laughs> announced that uh, they have started, there's, there's four or five uh, prisons already have been selected, and these prisons are Trat, Rayong, uh, Ratchaburi, and the Ratchasima. Uh, they're part of the startup project. And uh, what it is is where uh, tourists can visit the prison. Now, the details. Uh, we're not all that sure about, mm. uh, but it's a, it's an initiative. But the question is, is this something that should be done? And what's the opinion of the prisoners? Is one thing uh, looking at this as a, a, a rehabilitation process? Mm. Yeah, but I mean you'd mentioned before a couple of prisoners. Yeah? Mm. Uh, how do they well, feel when you get when they get it, visits? It's, this well, has been going on for a while, though. Visitors. Yeah? Yes, yes. But years ago in Khao San Road, there was a uh, like a bucket list for Thailand was visit, you know, B Bangkok Hilton. And That's because it's got fame, right? Yes, yeah. and what they would do is get on the ferry at um, the one nearest to Khao San Road and come mm. up on the ferry to Nontaburi, which costs about 15 baht. Uh, and they would be able to tick it off for this. But the guys said... Not go inside, though, just from... No, 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 they went... No, no, oh, you can't take photos outside oh. anyway. But 
they would go inside to visit the guys oh. and chat and promise them that they'd send money or write to them and that didn't always happen although it did in one case one famous case but um, normally the guys didn't like that because they could tell that the people went just to tick it off their bucket list mm. say I visited the Bangkok Hilton mm. and um, he said oh they, they, they thought they were like they called it the banana visits they thought they were like monkeys in mm. a cage so, so, so when you go and visit somebody, is it like uh, you see in, in, on, on television in the American ones, you've got a glass panel, yeah? But from what I understand, there's, you're, you're sitting here, yeah. and, there's a, and there's a mesh or something here, and, there's, and they're sitting way over there, and you're shouting, yeah? No. Uh, now, well, similar, similar to that, yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> but probably the distance is this far. Uh, bars and glass and a telephone, a gap. Bars and glass and a telephone. So it's like this, like you see in the movies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just talk, but you can't. In one of the prisons, you 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 do sit quite close to each other, and one of them I'm allowed because I go in as a um, British Embassy volunteer visitor. I actually go into the embassy room where, um, well, not just the embassy where the um, police go in to get statements and things done. So we actually sit quite close. With, with nothing between you? you oh, mean yes, in, in, yes. Interrogation room. Bars and glass, yes, yes. Right. Still on a phone. Well, that's a bit scary for the guys because I think they would like a, a nice young bird to turn up. Yeah. <laughs> they've got this old pension on. <laughs> well, do they do this, you know, the hand <laughs> yeah. on the... the want yeah, a yeah, 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 yeah. They do, they yes, do, they yes, do, yes. I know, yes. It's okay. quite... Um, I think with this yeah. uh, discussion, because mm. I'm confused because I have very strong feelings about it becoming a tourist attraction. I hate that. Yes. Uh, why are the government promoting tourism for prisons when they have all the other things that have worked so well in the past? Mm. I mean, you know, the sea, beaches, they've got Thai dancing, the culture, way of life, mountains, national parks, food. All right, people living in, you know, the Europe in the winter come over here for that. They go, oh, let's go round a prison. That's not the image that well, Thailand we should portray. Go to I, I would uh, I've well, been, that's I've, what it I've means. actually been inside on contact visits, but they are very much regulated and you know not they don't happen often. You, when you go in to visit, you're in a visiting area. Yeah. Beyond that is the prison. You know. It, uh, so you don't go in the prison. No, no. You go through the big golden gates at Bangkok, which are quite daunting. You mm. know, massive gates. Uh, but then you, you know, you see the guys, and you all sit in a row one side, and they're all in a row that side on phones. Do they wear shackles and stuff? Uh, it depends. If they're on death row, they do. Yeah. But, uh, right. I remember that article. But I don't know. Whether, I don't know whether they wear shackles now. There was, I think, Princess Sirindor went to visit once. N not even handcuffs, back. or oh, no, 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 no. It oh. was uh, shackles on their ankles. On the ankles, that looks so. Yeah, it was hey, they are prisoners. I think when they're transported, they do. But within the prison, with it, well, if they're transported, if they go to court, it's shackles for sure. Yes, mm. but within the prison, and they're um, what welded on. Right. You know, they can't take them off. Or if they have a shower, they're on. Oh, you, they're on all the time. All the time, yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why some of the I guys. I thought for being transported from A to B. Only, well, only when they go to court, they're, mm. they have shackles. Yeah. But other than that, and the sound of the shackles is daunting. Yeah. There's, there's a ball as well. They hold yeah? it. A string. No, yeah. they hold the string up. Yeah. So that, so that the. The ball, the that's in the old-fashioned prisoners. Have a ball. That was in, in the dandy. That was in the 18th Bino. century. <laughs> and remember the arrows on the, the, arrows on the, on the thing with yeah. the ball and chain. Hence, Cork in the yeah. cat, you know. That's, that's a saying, I've got me ball and chain. It's just a string that's holding the chains up. They just it? hold it up to make it easier the for ball. them to walk. <laughs> I got married, I got the old ball and chain. Yeah. I mean, you, 300 okay, years okay, ago. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so I think they don't have stocks anymore. You go back to the dark ages. As as for saying, at the, well, at the, mo at the moment, w what we no, should say no is kid. there are no tourists here anyway at the moment, mm. anyway. Mm. But I don't know how far, whether whether they want to visit prisons and show what they do inside prisons uh, by mm. teaching the men at the cooking yeah. and thing. At, at Bang Quang, they used to have a sale of plants and things. Yes, they have. I saw yes. they make furniture as used well. Used to right? make furniture, and they yeah. also had a pig farm inside yeah. uh, Bangkok at one time. 
I think my biggest problem is yeah. is the reasoning behind why the tourist wants to go. Yeah. I, I mean, yes. you know, there's enough people living here in Thailand to visit these yes. these, these markets yes. that they have, as you're saying, and to buy furniture. Just why have it on, you said, a bucket list? Because that's the Bangkok Hilton. That's been on so many movies. Mm. It's like going to see the Arc de Triomphe or the Eiffel Tower. Yes. It's, it's, it's a monument, yes, as it were. Yes, yes, yes. But to make prison... For the prisoners, I think it's demeaning. I think for yes. the tourist, what are you on? Yeah, that's yeah, that, that's yeah. what you want from a sunny uh, yeah. climate with yeah. beautiful beach, yeah, you yeah. know... No, I don't just I just don't get Unless it. But it, maybe it's just me. Well, here's, here's a question. Yeah, Thailand is, is is got all the cultural elements, but they have a, a have a Nana Plaza. Yeah, they have soy cowboy. All these things, which are you're seeing, you know, culture. It, you see culture. that's culture. Yes. Okay, yeah. uh, but you 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 see uh, that's a negative connotation. Like prisons, you see, is a negative con connotation. Prisons, but people are interested in it. Now, even uh, yeah. even if if uh, someone comes to you as a tourist. They will go into Nana or Soy Cowboy or a dinner party and they'll go and see it because it's something it's that, to see. Yeah. So why don't they do that in their own countries? Why, can, why travel 800 miles, whatever it is, uh, to, to go to a place not renowned, well, that's not high on prisons and things, to visit? Why don't you do that in your home country okay. if you're yeah. that interested? Yeah. I, mean, I, don't, I don't think you can in your, in your own country. You can't do... I mean, I remember I was, when I was a kid, yeah. uh, uh, and we, were, we were taken to Clyde Bank. Uh, which is a, it's, it's an industrial part of Glasgow. Yeah. And uh, we get taken into... Uh, take my glasses off. Uh, <laughs> uh, we, get, we get taken into the, the police station and we get taken down to the cells. Oh, really? And we, get, we, get, wow. we, we went into the cells More and, and the, door, the door went... Boom. Yeah, they do that yeah, in Alcatraz. Yeah. They do now, that the, re the reason they did that... Yeah, it was a deterrent. Not this, was a deterrent. See, this is, this is what it's going to be like. Yes. So I... Actually, for this, when they say tourist attraction, don't forget, we're not just talking about foreign foreigners, we're talking about local tourists as well. No, that, that's a different thing, though. The, the government are talking about putting it on the list of attractions, you know, the land of smiles yeah. and all this, like the beach, <laughs> the, the, put prisons on there, make it a tourist attraction, right. so, like the floating so, so market. Let, let, let's, okay, yeah. so there's, there's the connotation of tourist attraction, yeah? Uh, or, or the fact of tour, tourist attraction. Mm. What is it actually doing for, the, for, for a prisoner? Now, you say yeah. they feel like monkeys. But if there is something like you had an open area, so it's only trustees. Yeah, people yeah are it, it would only be trustees and, and certainly no foreign prisoners either. Right, or, right. Or may, interesting. Or, 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 yes. or maybe, maybe there is, I haven't defined that. Yeah? Mm, I, but so I doubt so say, for example, yeah. they're sitting and they go yeah, to the yeah, garden yeah, area yeah, and they're sitting yeah. and, they're, and, they're, and they're meeting people. What, people can get institutionalised and what they oh. want to do is try to bring them back mm. to, you know, this is the world outside. Yeah? So it's a benefit from the, from the prisoners to meet people from the outside. They know what questions are going to be asked. But they're not speaking to other prisoners. They're speaking to other people. They can ask questions about what's happening <laughs> here, what's this, what's yes. that, where it, in, in a more comfortable in, environment. Yeah? Yeah, but there's 54 million people live in Thailand. They can do that job probably better because they're not on a two-week jaunt from London. They go, oh, let's go and see uh, see out of the prisons. It's all <laughs> morbid, negative. There's people in Thailand that can keep that going, and yeah. which is good. For, I'm well, not saying it's bad well, for the prisoners if it's done in the right so way. So what you're saying is no t no foreign tourist should be allowed to go and visit. What I'm no. What I'm saying is it shouldn't be on a list of attractions to Thailand. But that's not up to them. That's up to the individual. That's as you're no, saying. Yes, that's yes. in the bucket. Their bucket. Yeah, yeah. yeah, but the government are promoting it as saying it's going to become a tourist attraction. Yeah, well, the, that, that word, too, along with the floating market, it will be. the Grand yeah, Temple, yeah. Klong Prem. But it will no. be. It will be. Because, all because all I can, that's why you yeah. have documentaries coming out all yeah, the time about yeah. prisons. People are just fascinated yeah. with it. And then in their own countries, maybe they can't visit. Now, it depends how far they're going into this. But yeah. I think the benefit of the prisoners, number one, if you have a Thai prisoner and if they have foreigners coming, how can they communicate? English, yeah. yeah so what yes. ends up happening yes. is that the, the foreign people inside end up, which they already do, yes, I understand, yes, yes. and start teaching them English with a purpose. Mm, yeah. Yes. So instead of here learn English and I won't use it for twenty years, yeah, mm -hmm. they're learning English and actually putting it into practice. Yeah. I, so, agree so all, I, I agree on all. I agree on all that. Really good rehabilitation but, opportunity. But, yeah. but the but the rules to get inside the prison to go actually inside to just to go and visit are bad enough. Mm. You have to register. And that's, you know, for the Thais, that's so e easy because, you know, they, they all speak Thai. For me, I, get, I have to get a letter 
uh, like a week before I want to go and visit somebody from the British Embassy, verifying who I am with my passport number mm. and saying that, that I can take two books in for the prisoner. Now, if there's any sort of Tom, Dick and Harry rock up at a prison, uh, how are well, they we going to... The yeah, no, we don't know the but, system But I'm just wondering how they would get how in. How they would get around this Because, one. you know, and also at the prison, the guards, there's not many, even the guards, not many that actually speak English. Mm. So, and we're saying English being, because that is the international language, whether the French and Germans like it or not, mm. it is. Mm. Um, and but they don't, yes, and they don't always speak. You know, they don't speak English. No, no, no English is a universal so maybe, language. Maybe what they may, may start off with like, is like an open day or, yeah. or sort of thing. Yeah, so, so very much. Well, they have open day. I think they, well, they have open day for, for families to visit. Mm. But then that's that's still restricted. But I mean, I think it's a good idea to get the prisoners doing something rather than just giving them a purpose, right? Giving them a purpose and mm -hmm. hopefully learning a skill whilst they're inside sure, yeah. that will benefit yeah. from them outside. And not because I do know, I can the um, the guys in the drug in the drug on Bombac Bombac Pisset, um, they say that the same Thai guys come in all the time. Yeah. You know, they go in, do a, not a very long sentence and go out, start selling the yabba again, get picked up and brought back in. You know, mm. it's like a, a way of life. I think, I think that's actually similar in, in most, in most yes. prison societies. Yes, when they're, yes. They're, 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 they're classed as, yes, they're, they're classed yes. as outcasts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, and and there, was, there was one story where the, pro, where the, 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 the son yeah, had gone in and they would say, oh, He's gone. We don't know where he is. And then, <laughs> when he when he started in an open prison and learned some skills, yes. yeah, then they were saying uh, that he's yeah, my son. Yes. He's in he's yes. in prison. Yes. And he's, yes. he's going to come out. Yeah. So th there, there was there was a guilt factor. It was it was, it was yeah. as, as you said before. It's how it affects the family. Yeah. Oh well, I I know through the the foreign the British guys that some of the families have been highly embarrassed and didn't tell anybody mm. the son had gone over to live overseas. They certainly didn't say that he was in prison and that he would be for a long time. It did come out eventually and the families supported them, but they didn't make it, it wasn't like a, a talking issue. <laughs> well, now, you, you know, now you're talking about how mm. the process would work in the prison. You came up with a figure. Is it 170 prisons they're thinking of doing this no, to? Well, out of 212 or something? It's 72 oh. out of, yeah. out of uh, the... 143 prisons. This is this is what they're, they're they're looking at just now. But you have to also look at wh why are they doing this at all. The easy thing is do nothing. Right? Yeah. So why yeah. would they do this at all? Part of it is because of the reputation. Yeah. Right? Yes. Now what they're also doing is which are coming in part two is uh, open prisons and the the how they're trying to adjust things because let everything in, in change in law or process. It has to be lobbied. There mm -hmm. has to be a starting starting mm -hmm. point. Yeah, yeah. So this is what they're trying to do: is take away, as they were saying, prison images uh, from what he calls twilight world to they're saying changing into a world of opportunities. So quite right. The, the, you know, they, they have uh, seventy percent or thirty percent, whatever it was, uh, but they, uh, an awful lot come back into the prison yes, as, as yes, you just yes, said. Yeah. So preparing yeah. them to go out. Now, if you've been in, in jail for twenty years. Mm. Yeah, there's cases in the UK yeah. where, or other other prisons around the world, where, where people have said, "Well, I want to go back into prison because yeah. I feel safer and and safer yeah. in that society well, because was, I'm nothing yeah. outside and I'm something here." Yeah, like that, that was a guy, a Thai guy in in Ban Quang. He'd been in for twenty years, but he'd set himself up. He did the food, and he had a little business. He had a, he had a a purpose in life really mm. to mm. provide the food. And, and that's it, how he looked upon it. Yes. Right? Yeah. And then when the, and he had, there was an amnesty and he was freed, he was horrified. And, and he actually went, you know, the, the Brits were telling me that he went said to the building, he said, what can I do? Can I, can I commit a crime that I can stay in? Yeah. Because his family lived up country because mm. he'd been in. Yeah. So they he had a roof over his head. Yes, they, they sort of stopped visiting after so many years. And he was beside himself. I don't really know what happened to him. I, Mm. So besidel, I would think, almost, mm. Mm. because well, he had no life other than prison. <laughs> I don't want to keep going back about this tourism thing, but yeah, well, I'm going to make another point. Yeah. Because you sort of mentioned how are they going to make the process of it with the guards not speaking. So I can imagine that 
<laughs> the tourists will pay whatever to go in, but they won't see hardly anything. Possibly. And probably will end up coming back complaining. No. Well, we only were in a garden. We couldn't yeah. go into a... I want to go into a jail well, 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 and have the gate closed. Well, I think you'd have something like in Canchonabury. When you go up to Hellfire Pass, yes. you go in there, they have a movie of all this stuff explaining things. Yes, da, da. Yeah, yeah. Don't forget why they're trying to do this. Yeah, yeah. They're doing this to create a better image for, for, for yes, Thailand. Yeah. Yes, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's not just for the prisoners. Is it? And, yeah, well, they're, they're, they're part of everything. I'm not, I'm not saying they're doing it just to cover themselves. No, they're doing it because they want to make a difference yeah, for the prisoners. You don't think they're looking for it as a revenue stream under the tourist attraction? Yeah, well, they are, may, that's, may, that's maybe, but I mean... The to support it, because it's expensive to hold it. 12 to billion up, baht yeah. is the budget a year for the prisons, <laughs> and 8 billion of that goes on food. So they've got 4 billion left. Yeah. So what are they Well, they're all do? saying that the prisons are overcrowded because the guys have told me, you know, that... When one turns, when they're lying down, one turns, everybody turns, you know, well, because they have like 18 inches to yeah, another sleep stat, in. Another yeah. stat, three to 400,000 inmates at the moment. Mm, and the, the capacity at the moment for, with all the prisons is 120,000. Yeah, 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 yeah. But also, I was, I was reading something else and they were saying uh, a lot of the, it's either most is drugs, yeah, right? So yeah. we know that. But an awful lot of crimes are done by incidents. At one one point of time, mm. they've lost their temper or whatever it is, mm -hmm. and then they're jailed, jailed yeah. for life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. the people going on this, obviously, they're going to be you're going to be evaluated, uh, and if maybe they're coming to the end of their term, yes, yeah, yes. Uh, where they go in this, which, which they have said, yeah, which I think is totally wrong. I think they should have the process all the way all through. All the time, yeah? absolutely. Right? Mm -hmm. Because yeah. because otherwise you do become institutionalised. Mm -hmm. yeah. So I think this is a great introduction for people who are going to be released, but also to keep sanity. Yeah? Are we going to talk about now, like the drug thing, or is that in the, no, second, in the second part? part. Oh, second okay. Part. All right, because I've got a whole so rant on that as well. Round off. Oh, I'm surprised. Are we treating questions? Are we treating the prisoners like mon monkeys behind bars? Yeah. Mm. Uh, uh, do you, do yeah. you think there's benefit to it? Have you changed your mind in any form? None whatsoever. Yeah. I would, I would, not, I as would. A, not as a Thailand tourist attraction. Yeah. It should be nowhere near any pamphlet. So you, so should it be, shouldn't be marketed, you're saying? It should exist, but for not For locals, marketed. for locals, it can be marketed, but it doesn't have to go on brochures when you're in the aeroplane on TG <laughs> coming in and go, oh, Grand Palace, Floating Market, prisons. Yeah. It's not the image of Thailand. Thailand well, land I tend of smiles to, I tend to positive. Agree, I, I tend to agree with that. It's, it's just basically like saying, uh, don't go down to uh, a soapy. Or, 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 they don't have that within the, within the, in yeah, the brochures yeah. when you yeah, arrive. Yeah, yeah, I mean, they yeah. all know yeah. it's there. Yeah. Yeah. It's so, a beautiful image of Thailand that we all love. I think they should keep. No, this I, still I, can I, go on. but I, I'll, yeah. I'll agree. I'll agree with you on that. I don't wow. think it should be marketed as a, a, a tourist attraction. I think okay. it should be something that should yeah. be there. That's yeah. my only problem with it. Right. I think I think probably the Thais having visitors go in wouldn't feel as bad as what foreign guy, foreign people felt. You know, if if Say again, I think sorry. they I think they would if if it, they would only see t the Thai prisoners anyway. So if, when foreigners went in, the Thais would. I think quite enjoy seeing a foreigner yes. or talking to a yes. foreigner. Their attitude towards foreign visitors would yes. be different to what foreign prisoners would be. Right. They, yes. You I know, guess. they yeah. they they yeah. wouldn't. I don't think the Thai prisoners would look at it as a. A banana visit, yeah, you know, a yeah, monkey visit. Right. But would, would, would the yeah. Thai Thai prisoners would they feel okay with Thai visitors? I think so. As well, I, I think so. Uh, Do you think it's educational for the public to say, "Listen, you don't want to get in the situation here." Well, you know, like, yes. I, I was I was put in the in the, in yeah, the cell in the, in yeah, the police station yeah, yeah, to have yeah. that experience. And you're going, "My God, I never want to be in that situation." Like and you've, be, and you've behaved yourself ever mind. since. Uh, no, <laughs> I've never yes, been arrested. <laughs> I've never been in a situation you you've never been to go into Explain that scar just bad. Did you get that right? <laughs> so you've never been caught. No, I think it it, it would be good. Oh, good boy, ask my mum. Yeah, yeah. I know uh, uh, somebody here who took our sons up to to Bang Kwang mm. and had the guy who was in there for a long term explain to her sons, don't get involved with drugs, don't start, don't. Don't just don't do it. Oh, no. And uh, well, it's like yeah. these driving licenses. I think licenses. that is good because yes. basically that person who said I made a mistake and it was yeah. an instant of a mistake, mm. yeah? or I or I got got uh, hooked on something, so I, yeah. I felt I had to go and do it. Yeah. It wasn't. It, it became no choice. Do you want to go? I get twenty years. I'm here for twenty years. Is that what you want? Yeah, the kids yes. go, yeah. Uh, I, I think it's like kids in America when they go for their driving license when they're told they, they're shown all these horror movies of car yeah, accidents. Yeah, yeah. And, I somehow inside me 
doesn't say it doesn't work, but somehow of parting that information that way doesn't sit well with me. For yeah. It's almost frightening somebody for something they haven't done that they might probably never will do. So why should they have the trauma because, of because that? Because in this day and age, this especially, some idiots especially will do. when it comes to drugs, it's everywhere. Yeah. Absolutely Majority. everywhere. And it's, it's uh, even when I was at college uh, and university, it was everywhere. Yeah. And I knew people were taking smack. Yeah. Mm. But the point was, I said no. Yeah, mm. and I, I, I had, I had the, not say wouldn't say foresight, but I just had the attitude. No, I'm not going to try that. Don't Cocaine start or anything it. Else. Don't yeah. start it. Well, I'm not going to go and give away anything. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> not personally anyway. Yeah. I think we'll. I think we'll, I think we'll yeah. leave it. <laughs> I, I think we'll. Well, it's not a bad image. Uh, I think we'll leave it there for now. Uh, we, we, thank you very much for so far. We're, you're going to come back on, on yes. part two where we're looking at open prisons, and rehabilitation, and drugs. Yes. Yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, if it's the first time watching, don't forget to subscribe if, if this is what you like. Also, of course, like and share. And that little bell, just go ding on there, and that means that you'll know when we've uploaded something. Is that it, guys? Yep, that's it. Thank you, Gail. Thanks, Gail. You're very welcome. See you yeah. in a moment. <laughs> see you guys. <laughs> well, no, I'm going to see you next week, as most to say. <laughs> <laughs> Same shirt, but never mind. <laughs> see you. Bangkok right. Chit Chat. <laughs>